everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Monday evening and I am about to put some chicken wings in. I've just, um, well not just, but I marinated them in um, hot smoked paprika, garlic, salt and pepper, olive oil and I've drizzled them with a bit of maple syrup so they're like sticky and sweet so I thought mmm that might be nice I'm just gonna sit down a minute because I don't need to put them in yet I'm just waiting for Matthew to come home and then then I'm gonna put them in so how's everyone been what have you been up to I've literally just been doing the usual today just washing, drying, sort of my bedroom out, change the bed. Um, yeah. Matthew's just popped to his brother's house. We've got the drawings for our last conversion and or attic conversion, whatever you call it. So Matthew's just popped to his brother's to show him the drawings and sorry about that, it was just my slipper dropping on the floor. And I was just watching a programme on the BBC iPlayer called Chloe, which is quite good if you want to go and have a look. It's like a drama, thriller, something like that. I'm just sitting on my sofa in the kitchen. If you haven't seen my kitchen before, this is my this is my little my little seating area. I'm after Matthew's uh Work bags there. That's my washing. My little coffee table. That's my son. That's my uh, Isabel. Yeah. Oh, that Matthew. You can hear Matthew's car now because he's got a bloody V8 supercharged, so you can hear him coming. Oh, I do that to go fast. It's just really loud. Boys and their toys. So, over the weekend, what did I do? It's a Friday. I did that haul for you after I come back to see Isabel. Um, Matthew picked my niece up from school. And she stayed here Friday, Saturday. Went home yesterday. On the Saturday... We just went round to visit family. Um, and then yesterday we had a chill out day. Casey went home. Uh, I didn't even make a roast dinner. Oh, sorry. It's that time of night where I get really tired. It's quarter to seven. So I do need to put that chicken on soon. I'm getting hungry now. Um, so yeah, we just we just had a chill out day and we were just watching films on Netflix. We watched the new Texas Chainsaw Massacre and it was bloody hilarious. So it's meant to be a horror, but it's just it's just pure gore. But it's yeah, you just gotta watch it. It's it's nothing like the um, the old Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Well, there's been a couple of remakes, hasn't there? But the one that was made sort of early 2000s, that was a lot more jumpier and a proper horror. This was, like, comical. Uh, and then we watched... What did we watch after that? I think it was called The Guest House. It just seemed really low budget, though. But we, we watched the whole thing. We did carry on watching it, but it was proper low budget. Um, yeah, and that's, that's it really. The weather was absolutely terrible over the weekend. We couldn't go and see Isabel yesterday. It was just really chucking it down all day. I'm sorry if this is wobbly. I've, I've got a really shaky hand. Just swap hands like that. I need to get myself a little bloody, um, what do you call it? Selfie stick. <laughs> I've actually got a selfie stick, but I should use it, shouldn't I? It might not be as wobbly. I need to get a proper tripod, really. Oh, well, a handhold one. Like that. Like that. 
Yeah, I'm just going to do the chicken wings. I think I'm just going to do some fries with, with the chicken wings. Keep it simple. I was going to do some coleslaw, but... No, I'm always tired on a Monday. Always. It's like the the weekend takes it out of me. And I don't know why, because I'm not, like, mega busy, but... Ooh, always, always tired on a Monday. Um, I'm going to go... And I'll catch up with you in a bit. Evening, everyone. I've just come upstairs just to take my makeup off and into bed. I'm having an early night. Yeah, I'm shattered. Um, for the last week, I gave up my bed for my niece because she came to stay. So, um, yeah, I, do you know what, it doesn't even matter if I get on my bed because 90% of the time I end up on the sofa anyway, I wake up in the middle of the night and I end up going down, putting the telly on and just falling asleep on the sofa. Uh, that is just... It seems to be like getting into a bit of a routine, so I know that I need to stop doing it, but I don't know how. Um, oh, that's a point I need to see my tablet. Take my antidepressant. I've just brushed my teeth and now I've got, this ain't got sugar in it though, have it? A bit rank after brushing my teeth though. Yeah. I just, I just want to get into my bed and sit with Tally on. I'm going to try, I'm going to watch a little bit of YouTube, but I'm going to try and put it down. So about half an hour, I'm trying to go to sleep because that's the thing with me. I'll start watching YouTube and before I know it, it's like one, two in the morning. I need to stop doing that. But, um, I have had some sleep today because I was absolutely shattered, which means that I'm probably going to struggle to sleep tonight, but I actually do feel tired, so hopefully not. Hopefully I will drift up. You know when you feel like your eyes are heavy? <clears throat> My voice has gone croaky, so I definitely sound tired. I know I, I know I've got quite a deep voice anyway, you probably noticed that if you watch my my channel for a while. But um yeah, I'm choosing on my cellar water. I'm nearly out of it, look. Oh nearly out of it. Not focusing very well. Did you have a nice weekend? Did you manage to get out or was the storm really bad where you are? Let me know in the comments below. I love um I love chatting to you guys. When you message me, I always comment back. I love having, having a bit of a chat and I will tell you what, some of the comments on it well actually all of the comments I get are absolutely lovely, they really are so nice. Uh, ah, looking really tired. What's that? Is that red on my um, eyebrow there? Um, I'll just put on the super booster that I was showing you in my makeup video the other day, the Liqueura one. I think that's the hyaluronic acid one, isn't it? Yeah, hyaluronic acid serum. I'm going to use my Look Your Watermelon Gel. I just do everything with a bit of little jingle, don't I? Do you know what? My mum keeps saying you need to do a jingle for your channel. You need to call it the jingle. So I would like to do that if anybody wants to help me out with my jingle. Let me know if, um, if you have any ideas. So that would be pretty cool as as you can probably tell um 
I do these little voices with my dog and I used to do it with my kids as well. Just come out with random, random voices and I say random things. So I would love a little jingle. I could probably come up with one if I really sat down and thought about it. My mum said she'll um, chill out me, so. Mm. I'm sure my stepdad will have some ideas as well. I'm going to put on some of this sanctuary. Um, sleep mist, lavender one. And then I always put up spray on my pillow as well before I get into bed. I don't think there's anything else I wanted to put on. Oh, and there's my cream on. Yeah, I'll put some eye cream on. I'll do this eye contour one. Eye contour cream. And, um, yeah, I'm just thinking about things. And my husband keeps um, doing this thing where he's, he's waking me up and he's waking himself up, laughing in his sleep. And when I ask him in the morning, he says that um, he's joking about with Isabel, that she's telling him jokes. Um, he can never remember what the joke is, but uh, when he wakes up as well, he's, he's, he's desperate to get back to sleep so he can see Isabel again. But what I can remember, I I don't think I've, I've dreamt about Isabel at all in the whole time that she's been gone. I think about, I think we used to dream about her more when she was here, but maybe I'm just not remembering, I'm not sure. But I'm dying to, I'm dying to dream about her because I feel like, um, when I try to dream about that, I um I can't see her face. It's either like the back of her or just she stood there in front of me but with no face. I hate this time and I'm walking up the stairs this time of night, I'd be going in a room and checking on her. <laughs> She'd probably just be putting her iPad or her phone down and going to sleep and I'd be tucking her in. Or she'd be fast asleep and I'd just go in and I'd just brush her hair. Brush her hair away from her forehead like that. Horrible feeling that I'm going to forget her face. I know I can't possibly because, you know, I see photographs all the time, but why would I try and, try and dream about it? Can I not see her face? What, what does that mean? I don't know. I was never really a cuddly person. Never have been with my kids I just love them so much oh this gives me a hug now and again but it's about used to literally every morning she used to come down and I used to say morning mama chick how are you diddling he used to come up and give me a cuddle and I used to kiss the top of her head. Her hair just smelled so nice and so soft and curly. Oh no, he's running off. He's going to get some tissue. Um, no, thanks for listening to me, guys. I'm not going to apologise for crying. I know I'd, I always apologise when I start crying, but I shouldn't because it's not my fault that. I feel sad that I keep crying. It's grief. And this is 
nearly a year and a half on. And when I think about it, and I cry, it still only seems like yesterday. So, right guys, um, I'll, um, I'll probably see you tomorrow for the Tuesday's vlog. Okay? Thanks guys. Night.